Hey guys, Brian the Cell Phone Guy here again. I got a request from a customer a little while ago to help them understand how much data they were using on their phone and what the best way to uh, control their data use and to understand just how much data certain apps use. So I thought we'd do a short series on how to, uh, how to look after that. So in this one, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a look at how much data YouTube actually uses on your uh, cellular plan. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to get to uh, your data reading so that you'll know which apps are using it. Now, for, for the purpose of this demonstration, we're using a Samsung S6, uh, which is running Marshmallow software. But this will work on basically any Android with just subtle differences. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go into settings. And then we're going to scroll down until we come to apps. And then this is gonna load the apps. Now what you're gonna see here is all the apps that you've used data. And if you look right here, for example, you'll see that the clock is used 132 kilobytes and documents is 110 megabytes. And basically this will tell you which is your heaviest um, usage applications. So what we're gonna do for the purposes of this one is we're gonna go all the way down to the end. Uh, this is alphabetical. So YouTube, no surprise, is gonna be at the end. So if we go to YouTube and we open it up, and then we go to mobile data. This is gonna tell us the basis what we're starting at. So right now this tells us that for the billing cycle, which in my case is monthly, so August 1st to August 31st, I've only used 3.27 megabytes. Now that's not a whole lot, but that's because this is one of my backup phones. So we're just gonna make a quick note, and write that down, and then we're gonna go back out of here and we're gonna go into settings. Oops, hang on. We're gonna go into apps, sorry. And we're gonna launch YouTube. And then we're gonna take a look at uh, one of my favorite uh, YouTube blogs. So this is uh, Mark Spagnolo with the Wood Whisperer. Now let's just see if I can get this to... Uh... There, we'll just get it to orientate right. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna leave this playing for half an hour and then we're gonna come back and take a look and see what we did. So hang in there and I'll be back in half an hour. Okay guys, I'm back, it's been a half an hour, so let's uh, just uh, turn Mark off here. Now we'll go back into settings and we'll go to apps and we'll scroll down to YouTube. And now we can see here that the total used is 252 megabytes. So 252 megabytes, we started out it was 3.18 megabytes, so that means it's used approximately 250 megabytes uh, in a half an hour, which works out to about a half a gig per hour. Now, this is gonna vary depending on the type of video that you're watching. Now, let me just show you something else here. If we go to apps, and we go to YouTube and we type in 4K. This is going to bring up 4K videos. And you can see here that it says 4K. Now, you got to be careful with 4K because although the standard definition that we were just watching, which is 720p, will use up somewhere between 0.7 and one gigabyte per hour. HD videos, on the other hand, will use up three gigs, and 4K videos can use up to seven gigs per hour. Now, this is really important to know because if your data plan, uh, like the average guy, only includes three to four gigs of data, this can get very expensive in a hurry. Now, excessive data usage is something that's becoming not only extremely expensive for consumers, but also becoming a burden on the networks. Over 50% of all the internet traffic in all of North America is on two sites, Netflix and YouTube. And this is having an effect on the cellular industry. So cellular carriers are devoting more and more resources to promoting data, uh, but also some carriers are limiting the speed uh, in order to uh, avoid congestion. So that just gives you a quick overview of what uh, some of the very expensive data 
products to do on your cell phone are. Uh, there's a lot of products out there that will use data. Some like uh, email um, and some simple apps won't use very much at all. But if you're worried about your data usage, this is one thing that you really have to address. And we'll show you in another video later on how you can go into your phone and you can set warning levels so that you get warnings and you can also set a cutoff so your phone will actually stop using uh, data when you get to a predetermined level. Of course, the other solution is to make sure you take advantage of Wi-Fi whenever it's available. So that does it for this. If you like, hit, if you like what you see, hit the like button. Uh, hit the subscribe button. I'll post a link in the, uh, in the details below to uh, uh, Mark Spagnolo's site, the uh, Wood Whisperer. It's an excellent site if you're into woodworking at all. And other than that, thanks for watching.